it's been a minute. A few thousand minutes, if we're being honest. It's been about ten months since I last recorded this, but my name is Noremek. No, this isn't some out-of-season April Fool's joke, or you dreaming. This is Animal Crossing New Horizons. It's been a while. I'll get into explaining where I've been. I mean, the channel's still inactive, but I want to talk about this series for this video and just reminisce and chill in the best way I know how. You see, this series has had over 200 episodes now, and my favourite ones to record have always been the ones that I do late at night. So I figured if I'm going to do a one-off video coming back to this game, I'm going to do it my way. So welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. But just about when is a... Well, let's be honest. Me and you are not surprised at this at all. But if Isabel would like to take us away on the other end of this loading screen, we can get into things. We're not going to go for any longer, we're not going to go for any shorter, you're going to get an episode, <laughs> as you would normally. And yeah, but I, it's it's been a minute though. It, it really legitimately has. Um, the last episode of this was... The only other episode so far that's come out this year, back in January, it was a Happy Home Paradise episode. I know at the time it would be the um <laughs> the last one for ten months, but yeah, we'll get into it. But good evening, everyone. I'm here with a late night broadcast. I hope I can make it through this. Right on, Jaffer. It's two forty six a.m. on Monday, November eighteenth, twenty twenty four. I don't have any big news to share with you all today, but I would like to touch on one seasonal topic. While going through my mental checklist this morning, I was really interrupted by an recent map belief. After brushing it off my head, I came to the realization that fall must be coming to an end. I do hope you all remember to enjoy this beautiful and vibrant time of the year before the winter sets in. It is possible to gather maple leaves with a net, you know. You can use them for DIY projects that will help you remember the joys of autumn all year long. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. So, I haven't been back in 10 months. I'm not sure if I'm ready to press A and actually see, see the town. But yeah, um, do I imagine I'm going to be interacting with a few villagers? Yeah, not too many though, I imagine they're asleep. As are most people at the good old time, of course, to three in the morning. <laughs> but hello you. There he is. And there he is. So, ooh. First things first, we have a major Nook Miles goal, apparently. Oh. Active Island Resident, this is my, uh... My 300th day active, is it? Way to rub it in. <laughs> so, first things first. We'll talk to Celeste and then we'll check mail, but oh, coming over here to the hobby camp items. I will use this chance to remind you guys the chance to get these is thinning. So, if you've not already hopped on Pocket Camp and got these, then I highly recommend you do because your chance to get them is, again, running out with the closure of the original Pocket Camp app. But first things first. Hello, Celeste. First person I see you back. Good evening, Daniel. Have you been admiring the sky? So many shooting stars tonight. Would you care to watch nature's most beautiful performance with me? Who did you soup? I almost forgot. I came across a recipe for an astronomical project in a book that jotted it down. I like you to have it. Don't let me know if you try building it, would you? I'll have a splendid rest of the night. I know I shall. Well, I guess we can have a look. I'm um, good to see some of the, um... <laughs> no, very good to see, actually, that some of the stuff is still muscle memory. As it damn well should be. So, um, let's check Mel. I, I want to kind of put off getting into having our yap before I, you know, I want to clear through all the, f you know, the, the, the stuff that feels like I'm a boy to do because it's an episode, but oh, only three things really. Oh, Happy Home Academy, you're getting an immediate toss, but thank you for letting my, you know, my house is S tier. Bank of a Nook, really, we've been gone that long for that little interest. And the, oh, not my bad, that's not, how do I throw you? Oh, I've got to have you open and then I can throw you on with you. Last but not least, Mom. Don't want this to be four, but let's see. Today, one year older and one year wiser. Maybe it's time to give broccoli another go. No, I don't. You'll always be my baby. Happy birthday. From Mom. Oh. That's <laughs> what she given us. Um, I don't know. I think it's Bells, isn't it? Nah, it's a homemade cake. Well, you know what? Almost two months late. In fact, it's my brother's birthday today. But... <laughs> I'll eat the entire thing. Oh yeah. So. It feels real weird to be back. <laughs> um, 
but yeah, as, as I was alluding to before though, I didn't know the last episode of this was going to be the last episode for a while. I, I legitimately didn't go into that episode with the intention to leave you guys like, hanging as long as I did. The channel, in short, just got busy. <laughs> Um, if you want your explanation, that's the, it's kind of the short one I can give you. We, we did just get busy. Um, after that last episode, I, um, picked up on recording some more things I'd thrown to the wayside, they picked up, and then it, it kind of became a matter of, you know, okay, like, is this series really needed? We've got GameCube, we've got City Folk, um, and, you know, since then we've faced out GameCube, gone back to New Leaf, it, there was always the question of do we need three Animal Crossing series running like we did back then. Um, well, the, the days on some of these notifications are gonna hurt me. Yeah. Yeah. But I got busy. I, I got busy. But it is my fault for not giving this series a proper hiatus video, which... Look, I'm gonna be making this video as I go along, up as I go along, so... This could have the hiatus label that will slapped in the title. It could not. We'll see. Oh! I come back on shooting stars? It's really trying to win me over. But yeah, um, this is, um, this is Toffee, isn't it, I believe? Or is it Jaffa? It's one of them. Again, my, my habit of naming things after, um, my cats and my relatives' cats remains well and alive. Um, the issue is, is that the only other cat I now have, uh, my uncle, um, he has a son, quite young, and they have a new cat called Panther, which is slightly less good of a town name than... So far, Mr. Jaffa and Toffee. But we'll make it work. We'll make it work in whatever way we can. <laughs> but yeah, um, so hopefully you guys have been good though. Um, I'm aware a lot of people did subscribe to this channel explicitly for, explicitly for New Horizons content. So if you're tuning in and are seeing this in your recommended going, what the fuck is this? He's alive? Um, yeah, I don't blame you to be fair. <laughs> Actually, you know all the good fossils, why not? But yeah, it's been a minute. Um, and it's my fault for not saying I was going to be a minute. Again, okay, they got busy and kind of pushed to the wayside. Um, and, and for context, it was always there, eyeing me down. Like, the, the prospect of playing it. But, you know, it's it's been a while here for the channel. I'll be I'll be, I'll be be honest, put my hands up and say I'm going to get carried away in other stuff. But, anyone, come on. Oh, lucky me. I got a sprongoid. Sprong yeah, sprongoid, as it is. But yeah, um, another reason is I was generally starting to feel the burnout of New Horizons and this save. Like, this is episode 217. And that didn't say, that doesn't mean I wasn't enjoying recording them, but it meant I was running out of things to do to justify me recording them, if that makes sense. So, hence, I, I was always going to plan to take all the break this year, I'm not going to lie. But I just didn't expect it to be in February. I was expecting it to be after the anniversary. Anniversary episode, then into anniversary, and then we come back on my birthday. It was the original plan that was rattling around in my brain. We just went on break a little earlier. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I, mean, I should probably catch you guys up. Again, for those of you that haven't been tuning into the series, this year has been pretty cool. Um, you know, I've been to see Sonic Symphony. I saw Girls Aloud twice. I went on a cruise. I'm going on another cruise. I'm booked in to see a whole load of other artists. I'm seeing Pitbull in February, um, Kenshi and Ezu March next year. Um, I, you know, I did start fiddling around with music after years of saying I should maybe give that a little try. Um, you know, we've made, you know, videos for Neramic 2. We've applied, um, to shows. In fact, ooh. I thought, but depending on when the last episode of this was... Since then, I may have had a phone bag for a TV show that I didn't end up getting on, but the fact I got one was crazy. It's It's been a very busy year. You know, I finally did keep him with the um, Danganronpa Let's Play. I, um, I think in the last episode, I did rewatch a skim dip um, at the beginning, and I, did, I was talking about how I effed up one of the recordings for that in that video. And the, keeping pace with that after years of putting it off, it's been it's been good, you know. This genuinely has been, it's been a very cool year. Did a lot of stuff, and not actively recording this did free up the slots and time on the channel for me to do all of the channel oriented stuff. Yeah, it meant I could finally get City Folk's episode count up to rival this, though still not yet overtake it. It's seven short though. <laughs> Maybe that's why I'm hesitant to bring this back, I don't know. But yeah. Um so I know some of you will be wanting to like skip to the end conclusion, so if this is coming back regularly. 
Um, again, we're making that up as we go along, though, so I'll see what my end conclusion is. But I have oddly missed this world. Um, one thing I have, re like, thought over time and time again is the idea of doing a Season 2 of this series, right? Where, let's be honest, I think you have an Animal Crossing to save for so long and eventually it loses steam. Like, I've done a lot of stuff on this island, and I'll admit, I'm really good at what I do. Like, this is a channel, well, this is an island that has been refined over years, and god damn it, rain or shine, it looks good. It's got a selection of villages and it, the design, I, I love this town, I genuinely do, I could not reset this town. And I think I would be killed <laughs> um, by many people if I did, because this is the town that ultimately got um, this channel really kick-started. Like, if, if you're here watching now as a modern viewer, um, you sincerely have the success of this New Horizons save and the series that came from it um, in order to thank. Because until then, we were stuck below 300 subscribers, and the success of that series just popped, like, whatever lid was on the channel off, and we've been running away with it ever since. It's been... It's been a crazy time. So, well, I can't reset this save, but I'm also aware, in terms of things just to do, I'm kind of at the same stage in City Folk, but kind of further along in it, and that's not just because of more episodes. Um, like in terms of aims and objective and stuff, right, if I had to list things I wanted to do on the, like, off the top of my head for this island, I'd kind of be out of luck. I, I know I want to get more stuff to decorate around here, there's like a specific festival lamp that I yearn for, deeply, night and day. Like, it's, it, it, it is my show it to me please Rachel moment, like I need that damn thing. They look cool, they remind me of Adabad and Sonic Unleashed. I must have planted that and entirely forgot about it. <laughs> so it feels weird playing this game again, I gotta admit. But it's, um... Yeah, th this town is... I can't reset really it, but... I don't know, I, I think... Maybe, maybe coming on will inspire me, in a way. I think maybe taking a break might be the thing I need to get deeper and out and have like a new lease of life on the series. Of course, do I think 2.56am, um, Grand Witch Mean Time, is the time to be doing that. No. But who knows? But who knows? Um, the series is not coming to an end yet, though. Like, remember the promise I made that I said, oh yeah, it's probably gonna like, end around episode 200? Yeah, well, that was a lie. That was a lie. <laughs> but, um, we'll see, we'll see. The series isn't ending, but whether or not it's coming back immediately, I'm still, still trying to figure out. Because I know that's going to be the last thing I kind of say for this video. So until then, boy will I be stalling. And by the way, I have a massive headache. I drank a load of alcohol watching a Girls Aloud concert before, so this really is... I'm smashing together the most iconic episodes of New Horizons. Because I'm getting deeply philosophical. I'm barely talking to my villagers, either because A, they're asleep, or B, I'm too busy yapping. And alcohol is in some level involved. If you've seen all 217 episodes of this series... A, I salute you, and B, God, you've probably seen this episode done before. In the good way, though, in, in the good way. I'm, like, I'm not drunk, I just have a banging headache from the, the shots of tequila. Anyways, where have you been? I feel like it's been a while. I saved a stack to be with you, but I forgot which pocket it was in, and then I sat on it. I'll get another one, and then we can eat that one together. Cool. Oh, what are you making, Cole? Check me out, I'm doing stuff. I'm stuff. I'm making me a signpost. One of the bugs in the forest with the DIY instructions on me here whilst I was sleeping last night. So I gotta build it before I forget what it even is. Check it out, plans for a signpost. I can teach you if you want. Yeah, teach me. Leave it to me. I got it all scrolled down right here, so just read this. If I can make it, then I bet you could do it in no time. Cool. Well, um, that's actually a thing I've not got based off his dialogue. See, some things stick in my head, but... If they give the option to, if you, yeah, if they give you the option to reject getting a um, a DIY recipe, that means you don't have it. Why is that the case? I don't know. Life's biggest question. Um, who else would be awake? I mean, I kind of just want to wish on stars, but yeah. And there's there's also the fishing demon in me that's like, you should fish, you should fish, boy. It's like, nah. God, I, I do I do love this town though. It's very. Oh, I feel so for something I made like. Ooh, going on four years and a bit ago that I did the majority of this, it still holds up really well. Like, I don't want to change anything because it's like, A, it's history, and B, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Like, I'm sorry, the we're open sign on the beach next to the nice zen thing. I mean, 
it doesn't look better than that. Plus, I'm sorry, the Sans outfit is immortal. Back in 2020, I had some phenomenal ideas. There is a reason this series popped off, I'm telling you. And then just the micro construction zone with the child's tricycle in there, that is a... <laughs> the fact that they got the laugh out of me just proves that my sense of humor has in fact unchanged. <gasps> oh, but seriously, is nobody else awake? I mean, it'd be kind of funny if it was just Cole that's awake, because Cole's consistently remained one of our oldest villages, and at least one that I have loved for the longest. Um, so let's see, other houses, other houses, we've already checked up TV and those two down there, those two up there. There really isn't anybody else, is there? I mean, I can check Pierre and Chadwick for posterity. Assuming, I know Pierre's house is right, uh, the one I'm assuming Chadwick's maybe slightly wrong, but we'll have a gander. And there it is. Yeah, I wanted this video to go until 3am, I don't know why. Some, some, my brain works in mysterious ways when it comes to recording late night videos, but I hear the revive. Case in point. I love this track. It's it's, it's beautiful. It, it, it's an art, and the fact that people don't like it doesn't irritate me. Because I think getting irritated over something like that is silly. But, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. I really like planting my money trees, don't I? Um. Oh. Oh, okay. The intelligent investor I see. Go you. Mr. Forward Planning. Go him. So can we match this up? Yeah, we okay, we got it. No, I wanna leave I wanna leave it matched. Let me leave it matched. There we are. Thank you, Giovanni. <laughs> you know what? Hi Celeste. I feel so we're overdue for a trip into the roost. I feel so I need that to really push my brain into overdrive. Because again, it's been a bit, I, I, again, I love the 3am music, there was no way I was going to do this video solely in 2am, I was going to drag it out until past 3. <laughs> in fact, an export crashed, so I had to like redo um, part of the um, backing music, so it was a hardcore video. And uh, <laughs> I was like, yes! It's like, well, 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 no, on the one side, you know, I've got to redo this, but then it's like, yes, I can redo this, and that'll make it so the regular length of the video will push us past 3. Sometimes it's the small things in life, you know? Anyway. So I watched the episode before this, right? And when I was in here, I was thinking and throwing out the idea that, okay, the Switch 2 is allegedly going to be announced this financial year. So we've got four months until that comes true. Obviously, in the ten months since that episode did not happen. Uh, that was what I call a lie. Uh, but I was throwing around the idea that a new Animal Crossing game is sooner than rather later away. Uh, and since then, uh, they've announced the Coach of Pocket Camp. And if you've followed the video I made on the second channel about that, you know that my opinion is that they're possibly moving the dev team full time over to working on a newer game that could tie in to the new game. Um, because Pocket Camp never really could, and uh, for reasons I've kind of outlined in that video, it just it was late, so it couldn't do it with New Leaf's uh, Welcome Amiibo, and they couldn't link with New Horizons because it was a game that was intrinsically made for New Leaf. So I think for a newer game, having a bespoke app that functions like Pocket Camp, and then so having a gameplay loop but can directly link with the game is, you'd be stupid not to, you know. Plus, I think now Nintendo have learned their lesson about not porting mobile exclusive items to a mainline game. Because the people will riot. Oh, thank you, Brewster. I will. I will do that. Oh, I love the way that looks. I could so go for a coffee right now, but God, is my head hurting and I do not want to listen to a kettle boil. Now that's coffee. It's still mad, but the full-bodied flavor still shines through. Delightful. It did just... Oh, it's... it's it, at, at expense of sounding like a uh, broken record, it has been crazy long. But, oh, hello, child. It's three a.m. What are you doing? Good evening, Daniel. Putting midnight oil. Me too. You are six years old. You mean it's six years old? God damn. Once I get a whiff of that coffee, the wind gets so much harder. Hmm. You, you, bro, child, you developed my sleep schedule at like age six or eight, and I have to commend that. See you later, Daniel. Yeah, you, you, you're just saying that as though, like, I've not been in a coma in this game. And away he goes. Away he goes, just like that. <laughs> you know, actually, coming in here did jog my memory a little. So, in case you don't know, the research to show that once you start a task, it will bother you 
if you leave it unfinished, right? So let's say, for instance, I started editing a second channel video and that file was sat there on my desktop. If I just like import the stuff and I do the bare minimum to get it ready, it won't bother me. But if I go in and say edit like a minute of that video, all of a sudden my brain is going, nah, unfinished task. Get your ass in gear, boy. And to an end, I have the same approach to Let's Plays. Look, it still bothers me now, I've not finished my Wind Waker Let's Play, the fight, despite the fact I don't want to. So it was bothering me, because this series was definitely an unfinished task, until I stick an end on a series, it's not done. Or at least if I don't stick it on hiatus, it's not done. I need to have plans to assess my fossils, why the hell did I leave the museum? Um... So, it, it, it did bother me though that the series was on hiatus. And also, I just want to let you guys know, I will never not randomly cut a series short without good reason. Again, the only time I've done that in recent memory is Wind Waker, because I just physically could not bring myself to do those recordings and make them entertaining. <laughs> because the island is called Jaffa, good to know. Um, however, um, I have this story from years ago. Um, it was 2013, so 11-ish years ago, 11 and a half years ago. I watched a YouTuber called Kips. He doesn't really upload much anymore. Um, kind of COVID, he stopped. I think he's still alive, though. But, can I... Were any of those available to be donated, or... No. I guess I'll just put them in the uh, deposit box. Which is called Kips. And he had a, a few series. Uh, but there was one, namely, and it was his SimCity series. And he never finished it. And... He didn't have to. The first one, EA lost the save, and the second one, they just lost interest. But, you know, 11 and a half years ago, I would have been, what, 10? 11? So, that bothered me, because I love that series. It got me to buy um, SimCity 5 and The, the Sims 4 by proxy. Um, it, was, it, 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 was, it was just good. There's, there's, no, there's no way around it. It was just mint. Uh, we already had KK Safari, I think. Anything else I can sell? Anything else you can sell? I'm gonna say no. Yeah, I'll hold on to everything else just for the sake of it. But it bothered me to never finish that series, and over, over over the year, that's the first one, over the years I've also noticed other people start a series and not finish it. And they're always on games that never have a definitive end. Sometimes it's like a, you know, a serialized game, but usually a game with no end, and it doesn't get an end, end episode. So sad back in, I have always got this promise where it's like, okay, if I can help it, I will try and finish any series I start, rain or shine, Unless it reaches, like, critical mass, like Wind Waker did, where it's, like, months between an episode, and I don't even want to record it then. <laughs> it's, um... I, I try and finish it, because I don't want my viewers to be me in that position, you know? It's like, um... That, that, I mean, we spoke about Dangerman before, that's, like, the closest I came to acting on that. Because initially, you know, the momentum of that series was awful. But I, I pulled myself out and I was like, no, there are people that have waited years to watch this. The least I can do is finish the first the damn game. And then I pulled myself out and I ended up really enjoying it. Um, but um, yeah, I always try to make sure a series is done and completed and fulfilled. Because if I don't, it just... It doesn't sit right with me. It's like, you know, I made a promise as a 12, 13 year old just starting YouTube. And I plan to stick with it. You know, I feel as though you make, you make promises as a young person. You have like at least like in my experience, I feel like a duty to want to see them through. I don't know if that's silly or not, but I always do want to see a series through should I be able to help it. And in fact, I can list, yeah, Wind Waker is the only one I've not done. And the thing is, knowing me, I, in, in some years' time, maybe I will go back and finish Wind Waker. It's crazy. But, yeah, I, 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 I um, it, it's just, I don't know, I have all the weird bit feelings about the series because to kind of tie that in, Okay, I've got to draw a conclusion at some point, guys. At some point, this series has to end. Let's be honest. Let's not beat around the bush. This isn't City Folk. This is New Horizons, where... I've kind of done everything. You know, walking around the town today, I just felt really proud of myself. Like, in my head, this is done. There is a few areas... Name of that area full of flowers that I was using for breeding. That, yeah, I could go in and fix up and stick something there. But I generally feel quite proud of the town. It, it feels done. So what content remains in this is Happy on Paradise, which if you go through the post notes, I did ramp up purposely. And then kind of city focus content where I run into a routine, chat to the village, just come on, chill with you guys. And I just wanted to ask if you guys would be chill with that, because 
this is not a return to weekly New Horizons as it once was. Like that, that'd be silly to assume. This is not the immediate return of this series. This is more me. I'm gonna say as of right now, putting feelers out. Okay, because I don't know. You know. I don't know if the series is gonna right to come back at this time, but I wonder what feels out to you people would be interested in seeing this series continue. Because there's something I don't like like I've not taken many rides with Catherine. That's unfinished. Happy Home Paradise, that's still unfinished. And maybe just chilling camp hanging with villagers, that's still unfinished. And you goddamn know what? When I started this game, I was obsessed with flicking out the Critopedia and donating every goddamn thing I could find into the museum. And you know what? That shit's still unfinished. <laughs> so the stuff we can do. It's not, say, the, um... What we're doing for most of the series. It's not building the town. But if I can out with villagers, me trying to maybe finish my museum after all these years, going to see what the hell is on the other end of Catherine's thing, and occasionally maybe touching at parts of the town that I think we maybe need to do. Plus maybe a little bit of frab reading in between. If you guys are chill with that, well, I think I could chill with that. I mean, this is the Animal Crossing game I've come the closest to 100%ing in terms of the museum, so... Why slop just short? So, uh... That's my offer. If you guys are okay with that, if this video does well... I'll come back. Sooner rather than later, I'll come back eventually, but... If you guys are okay with that in the immediate future... I'll come on back. And it's been 10 months, I figured as though, at the very least, if we don't return immediately, for whatever reason that may be, I at least owed you guys a courtesy episode. You know, I feel as though, let us have some goddamn decency in this channel for once and, uh, you know, occasionally show up. The Wind Waker Let's Play could never. God, I'm gonna bully myself into going and finishing that now, I can tell. I can tell. I might message a friend who's gonna who will like double bully me into doing it. If you fucking see a Wind Waker video pop up in your sub box, by the way, just know that stems from this recording, and I'm not proud of that fact. <laughs> and maybe I will be, because I can go. Mm -hmm, what unfinished series is? Who who are they? I do not know the Steva. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Also, wow, we're wishing on a lot of stars. I is that something I can do with? Is that like spawn those star fragments? I don't know. It might be good to stand. I think. Actually, yeah, here it works in the, in the little flower of um. For context, I made this um. Okay, I'm gonna start a bit more over this way, I think. Yeah, but um, yeah, this field of flowers I planted dead early on in the series um, as way to um, mock the uh, better watering cow mass recipes, I think. Looks like it looks really nice. It's got blocks of flowers together, sure with a few hybrids in, but I don't know. It just it's got a charm about it, even though it's just unorganized and disjointed. I think. Even stuff like that, you can just find appreciation and then go, yeah, you know, it was cool. It looks nice. I The area around my house is just something that's cool. And I, I did stop expanding over this way. Maybe I should... Maybe I should allow it to just go crazy like it did back when. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll stick something in. There's still work to do. This series isn't done, is the main takeaway. Hopefully you're all having a good late night, by the way. It's, uh... It's been nice, though, to catch up. And maybe I'll be seeing you guys sooner rather than later. I know, I've left this recording with... It's, I don't know how to describe it, it's like my heart's grinning. It's like, my heart's grinning like, yeah. You know, you know your answer. I'm just gonna see how the... I'm gonna, as, as a courtesy, see how the response to this goes, but I feel as though I know my answer. My heart's grinning and saying, yeah, you know you're back in the game with this one. So apologies for the 10 month and a bit wait. I really should have given you guys a hiatus this episode. So... Apologies for anybody who was legitimately waiting for this series to come back because they enjoyed it. But, uh, I'm not going to give you guys a concrete answer, but, uh, if you are hoping for this series to come back, thank you for not your sub box. Maybe it will. Maybe it will. Maybe it will. We'll be back before the end of the year, though, is uh, the only promise I'll give. Not only because I like having it start off 12 days in Remick, because I think it's nice, but, yeah. Seriously, I've gone on for way longer. I'm eyeing my thing. What do you mean we've been going for 30 minutes and 30 seconds? It's 3.30 a.m. I should go the fuck to bed. Ah, <laughs> oh, seriously. I legitimately do love the late night episodes. There episodes of this. I myself to ramble on a bit more. I love them. 
I love watching them back and I love recording them. Just a little bit of thrill, knowing that if I raise my voice too much, I might end up waking somebody up and getting them slightly agitated. I don't know, I, I enjoy the thrill of it. Oh, there is always the, uh, the elusive one, though. I think we've the latest we've done is 4 a.m. Correct me if I'm wrong. 5 a.m. still awaits. I don't know. Just had a few moments of silence to think about legitimately. At the ripe old age of, age of 22, want to do an episode of Animal Crossing at 5 in the morning. They'll either wake up super early or stay up super late. Nah. I feel as if there's one thing I've learned in the four and a half now years this series has been running. It's I'm definitely more of a night person than a day person. Just let me know. Let me know in the comments all your different thoughts. Let me know. 5am episode? Actually, no. I'll make you guys a deal. I'll make you guys a deal. How about this? This series probably isn't going to be great because it's been on hiatus for ages. So, five likes. You get your 5am episode. And I'll even go one further. Five likes. Not only do you get that episode, you get it within the week. I mean, obviously, I could still go on hiatus after that, but we'll see. We'll see if we can hit that. I might record a more normal, um, chilling episode where I work towards one of those goals I mentioned earlier beforehand, if that does happen, but five likes and you get your 5am episode within the week. If I'm really insane, I could stay within the next five days. <laughs> but I'll stay within the week, give myself some more leeway to get a normal video where I'm not mumbling. God. It's been great, though. It, it, it's been great. I'm not ready to say goodbye to this game yet, as what this video has taught me. I don't know, there's... I feel like acutely emotional. I'm not showing it outwardly, but genuinely, it's uh, this this little bundle of zero and ones that does constitute this island. It's been with me through thick and thin, so uh, I'm not ready to say goodbye just yet. It, it's underpinned a notable portion of my life, maybe less so than um the city folk safe, but it's been that. It's been that. So I want to be there again too. So yeah, that's uh make of that takeaway what you will. And until next time, with all that said, I'm all on the other side. Thanks for watching guys. My name is Naramek. Go the hell to sleep if you're watching this around the same time I was recording this. <laughs> and peace out.